everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another weekly vlog i hope it's a weekly vlog and not a vlogmas vlog i think that's what it is yeah it's the day after christmas and i wanted to do kind of like a little mini um what i got for christmas haul i'm excited about some of the things i got and maybe this will give you some ideas about things that you would like to have but i'm just gonna go through a few things some of my favorite pieces and share with you guys what i got so i got <sighs> A few vlogger things from Brandon for Christmas this year. I got a new new Moa tripod. It's one of those tripods with the buttons on it that you can um, connect to your camera and it has the record, um, power button, and zoom. Um, I am so excited about this because the tripod that I've been using is just like a regular desk tripod. I also got this um, camera rig that I attached to the bottom of the camera. It's on it right now so I can't really show you it. But I did do kind of like a mini unboxing of it on TikTok if you want to go check it out. But this is going to be such a time saver because I attach it to the bottom of my camera. And it makes it easier to take the battery and memory card out if I need to change it out. Because usually, especially if it's on a tripod, I would have to take off the tripod, take off the bottom plate, and then remove the battery, change the battery, put it back in. And it's a hassle when you're recording and you're really into something and then the battery is suddenly dying. Um, and it's on a tripod and I just have to take everything off so it just makes it easier where I don't have to do that because there's a little slot for me to be able to open it out so I'm excited about this I for the longest I've told Brandon that I didn't need it but I was like who am I kidding it'll be super helpful so I'm not surprised that he got this for me because he's been telling me for months you need one of the mounting rigs and he got it for me this next thing I got is a external hard drive if you guys have watched the last few episodes of my vlogmas you will know that my external hard drive died on me heartbreaking I know but it died like two or three days before Christmas and I was so sad um and I think I was venting to my mom about it because we had recorded a video together and I lost all that data so um she had went out and was buying Christmas presents and I guess she picked this one up for me um, it's the SanDisk 1TB portable SSD and Brandon had told me that this is a really really good one and I'm guessing that he spoke to my mom about it but yeah very excited to start using this I definitely want to get another um, hard drive just to back up my content so that it doesn't happen again but this will definitely be the main one and I really really am excited about it and funny story Brandon also got one of these yesterday as well from my cousin um, he bought Brandon one of these because he knows he's like, doing film and photography, so he got him one of these, but his will be a, um, a two terabyte, which is really funny. They had no idea that they were both getting, that we were both getting these, so it was just a funny coincidence. Oh, yeah, this is his, the two terabyte. <laughs> the next thing I got was this full version of Replica Coffee Break. You guys, so I, you, you guys know, if you watch my channel, you know that I'm a notorious for never getting full-size versions of items. I don't get like the full-size primers, I don't get the full-size um, setting sprays, and I've been getting the travel-size version of Coffee Break for almost a year. So um, I had asked Brandon um, at one point, I think it was a while ago, I asked him if I can get um, for Christmas like the travel-size, it was like a gift set of travel-size versions of different scents from Replica. So I pulled this out on Christmas morning. You guys will probably see it in the video. Um, I didn't know that he was going to get the full size version of this for me. So it literally almost made me cry because I I just I don't splurge on myself like this. So seeing that he got this for me, it, it was it was really sweet. Um, and he's like, yeah, now you have the full size version. Like I <laughs> it's the funniest thing. Like, I don't know. And this is honestly my first perfume full size in a long time. I don't. I just don't splurge on myself like this so for me to have for him to have gotten this for me it was like it it almost made me cry but I'm excited because I love coffee break so I also asked for some rosehip oil from the ordinary I've been wanting to try rosehip oil on the skin um, I've heard a lot of good positive things about it so I'm excited to try this as well and you guys know I've been like doing a lot better with my skincare routine so um, definitely something that I'm gonna get into oh this was actually another Christmas present from Genesis it's these little this little rein reindeer headband and I think it's super cute um, perfect to do like makeup and stuff in the morning but 
I was like, yeah, it's a vibe for, for the video. I got these two um, things from Brian's sister, and I thought it was so cute because she didn't even really know that I love planners, and she got me a 2023 planner. Um, I thought it was adorable. She also got me this set of, like, warming slippers. Um, I'm not sure how to use them. I actually took off the... It was like a wrap around that shows you what, how to use them. Um, but I think you can heat it up in the microwave because they have like little beads inside. Um, you heat it up and then you can put it on your feet and it's really just really warming. So I think that's really cute that she got that for me. So I told my mom that I want to start getting like little, little accessories here and there to go to work in. Um, like little pieces of jewelry. I don't really want anything super expensive. Just to start off like a little collection of things. And she picked up a couple um, pieces from the store that I really like in the mall called La Visa or La Visa. I don't know how to say it. A bunch of little different gift sets. So these gold, um, silver and gold hoops. And then this necklace, which is so cute. It has a little um, locket, like a little key and chain on it. And then this silver one. From Genesis, a stress relief and what is it? Stress relief and self care card pack, and then a little cute little candle. She also gave me a bunch of Harry Potter socks, which she is notorious for getting me Harry Potter socks, and they're all so fuzzy, and I love them so much. I asked her like, how is it that you find new socks every single year? I don't know. And she also got me these cute little post-it set with a little pen and some gnomes on it. I can always use these on my desk. And this adorable little like catch-all kind of container. And it says, good friends are like stars. You don't always see them, but you know they're always there. And I think it's really cute. I'm gonna use it on my desk, in my um, my, on my makeup desk, to put like my jewelry pieces when I take them off because I like to leave them all over the house sometimes and that's not good. She also got me this little watch band. Oh, it's so cute. It's like glittery. Um, and dark. I love it. I think it's adorable. It's funny because I got her a watch band too, but it was a Hocus Pocus one, and I was like, you know, you can save it for, for Salem when we go to Salem. Okay, so I think those are all, like, the small things that I got. I think those are the small things. Let me bring over a few of the other stuff. <gasps> so, last year for Christmas... Um, I asked my mom to get me some like clear like those um, mugs like coffee mugs that are clear but they're like double lined inside because I've been seeing them everywhere and I'm obsessed with them and she got them for me last year but throughout the year all of them broke um, and it wasn't just me like it was a, one of my friends my mom broke one Brandon, I think I, I think I broke one too I don't know like it was they just all ended up breaking so I asked for another pack my mom didn't end up getting it for me, but one of my cousins did, which is hilarious because they didn't even know that I wanted it. So my cousin got me this double lined, what is it, double wall thermo glass um, from Bodum, I think it is. Um, and I'm excited. There's four of them in here. I'm just obsessed with them. And I, was, I wasn't sad that they broke because you can get them anywhere, but I just really wanted another set. So I'm glad that um, someone got that. And the next thing I got from my other cousin was a wine gift set. So this is, I think it comes with a wine opener, a foil cutter, wine aerator, a wine preserver, a charging base, two wine stoppers, and the power adapter. So I think this is perfect. Like we can have this sitting on our bar cart um, for any wine bottles and I think it's so cute. It's an electric wine opener. And then the last thing I got was from my aunt and it's hilarious because she asked me to send her a list of things that I wanted I told her I would, but I never did. I completely forgot, so she had to go on her own and try to find some things for me. Um, and she basically got this for Brandon and I, for both of us. It's this water pick water flosser. I did not tell her that I needed this or that I wanted this, but when Brandon opened it, I was cracking up because it's like I literally walked like through a Bed Bath & Beyond with him like two days before. And I saw one of these and I was like, you know, we need to get one because it'll be super helpful with my Invisalign and things like that. And the fact that she got this for me, it was the most funniest thing because it was like, I literally said this two days ago, like how, how do you people know? But I'm definitely going to make use of this and find a spot in the bathroom where we can put this. It's kind of big, but we'll make do. We'll find, we'll find a spot. I think that's it. 
Oh, no. So my mom got me a pair of workout tights because always. It's just this cute, like, tie-dye looking blue. And I think the brand is Exertion. Exertion? Exertion. Um, they feel super soft. This, um, ooh. <laughs> this Champion hoodie set. Um, and this is an extra large. I did ask for an extra large. Um, it might be a little too big, but it's fine. I'll wear it huge. I don't care. For, like, hoodies and, like, sweatsuit sets in, in general, I think that that'll be the best. And then the, the black sweats that go with it. So, yeah. I'm excited for that. It's a little champion. So that would be everything, I think, that I got this year. Um, I just wanted to share a little bit with you guys, but this is not like a formal sit down video But I think I'm gonna start cleaning up now because if you see the floor in this living room It's just it's wild today. Um after everything last night. I was like, I'm not cleaning up Yesterday it was just a day to just relax and chill and hang out um, I had the best time the last two days with Brian's family and then my family and We just really got to chill and hang out um, we waited for some family to come over yesterday to open gifts because we're a very like early morning gift opener family but we're like we decided to wait for them to come by so we opened gifts around 1 p.m yesterday or 2 p.m um and that took a while because we all took turns like opening gifts um as we went along but it was really sweet and then after we ate and then um we watched Jurassic World and I fell asleep <laughs> but it was it was such a warm cozy feeling that you know we're all sitting in front of the tv um my mom's in the kitchen with my aunt and they're just like talking and it's just it was it was nice to have that experience um and it's probably one of my favorite things about christmas just the warm family close feeling that we had um and we stayed a little later um we took some pictures we just hung out with my family and then we came upstairs and brenner and i watched Pinocchio up here last night and we put um, um we put up the hookah we made another drink and we just kind of closed off the night with a movie and then we went to bed after and here we are so I can honestly say that Christmas has been successful this year and it's one of I think it was shocking me because I was so stressed about Christmas this year and I don't know for what reason but I was so stressed and the last two days was just probably one of the best Christmases I've had in a long time. There was something special and something different about this one that made me really, really enjoy and appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoyed Vlogmas this year. I tried my best to, you know, add different flair to everything and, and to try some new things, try to try some new like video styles and topics and things like that. It was fun, but I'm glad Vlogmas is over. Like, not even gonna lie. I can't like, Editing every single day for this month, it was so, 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 so stressful. And Brandon told me that he probably thinks that my hard drive died because I was just overworking it. <laughs> like, every single day I was adding new things to it, taking things out. It was just like, yeah, he, think, he thinks that I just, I kind of caused that. Which, in a way, is a good thing because it just shows how hard I was working this whole month to get content out. And I'm really proud of myself for that. So I'm not too upset about the hard drive dying. So right now what I'm trying to do is just separate all the gifts into the rooms that they're going to be staying, like they're going to be going into. So I just put the mugs and the wine opener into the kitchen. I'm going to move things around. And then once I move them around, I'll put them in the places that they need to go.
I also didn't mention that my mom got me this new garbage can, but she got two of them, one for recycle and one for garbage, but they don't both fit here. So I'm going to have to do some move maneuvering in the kitchen to figure out where I can put the other one. But I'm probably going to keep the garbage here and then the recycle on the other side. Because these are so tiny, I've been asking for a new garbage bin for the longest. And I wanted to get one with like double sides so we can put it right here. And then they also have like the foot pedal thing. So we got these when we first moved in. So they're like kind of old and crummy now. Um, so I'm going to replace that with these. Okay guys, so I am back. Well, you didn't even know I left actually. I went to Best Buy to um, exchange something with my dad. We bought him a speaker for his like sound, like surround sound home theater system, but it doesn't go with his setup that he currently has. So we had to go and exchange that. That took a minute. I need like a garbage bag. I have to clear up my desk. It's a mess with all these festivities of the last few weeks. I just need to clear off the workspace itself. Do you get what I'm saying? I have all these Polaroids here that need to be sorted and need to go up. Now I have space to actually put my hand on my desk. So I recorded a couple of like unboxings from like the, the equipment and stuff that I got. I'm still trying to figure out how to maneuver this tripod, but um, I just unboxed the hard drive and it's the SanDisk, um, the one terabyte, like I showed you guys earlier. I'm going to plug it into my laptop now. It's so tiny. Like this is my other one, the one that just died. It was a WD Elements and this is the SanDisk. Like what? That's crazy. I feel like this isn't even a hard drive. Like in my mind, it's like telling me that it's not. So what I'm going to do right now is organize the external hard drive into like little folders, which is what I've done in the past just to keep everything cohesive on the drive so that I know where everything is. I'll check back in with you guys after I have everything sorted out because it's going to take me a minute. Oh my god, guys. I just sat up in the computer and did so many like random little things that I've been meaning to do. Um, I am freezing because <laughs> my house, I put down the heat earlier and now it's so cold. Um, but I need to get ready to get a workout done. I organized my files. I made a new intro for 2023. Like, and the, see, that's the whole thing. Like why I wasn't so upset about everything being deleted from like, well, not deleted, but like my hard drive crashing because I was kind of looking to do a like brand youtube page reset anyway even without it like dying on me so the fact that i lost all my like my thumbnails and my like kind of intro like clip um it didn't really bother me too much because i knew i was gonna do it anyway it's just that one video that i ended up losing was super painful but it's fine i'm gonna have to do another video with my mom as soon as possible i am taking her to sojo spa tomorrow and i'm really excited because she's never been and i think i mentioned to you guys actually that i'm doing that but um tomorrow's her birthday so i wanted to i'm gonna have to learn to not just randomly press buttons on this tripod because i just shut the camera off while i was talking but <laughs> um i just wanted to treat her for her birthday so we'll be going tomorrow at 12 p.m so it's gonna be I hope it should be fun. I hope she has a good time. It's freezing, so hopefully the water, like her being in the water and then like being um, in the cold isn't going to be too much of an issue. But I think it should be okay. I'm changing out of my Uggs so I can put my sneakers on. It also sucks because I, I'm on my period. And I'm going to have to go in the water tomorrow. Obviously, it's not that big of a deal. I also have to text my coworker to make sure that she is aware or still remembers that she's covering me tomorrow. No, but like, you guys really don't understand. Now the sweater's cold. Jeez, oh, why did I turn down the heat? That's me for you. 
Oh, I need to take out my Invisalign. My house is clean, so I'm just kind of chilling, you know? Um, yeah, I'll get back to you guys. Most likely when I'm done with my workout. And I haven't even eaten today. Oh my god. I'm a mess. <laughs> ah. Good morning, everyone. It is... What day is it? December 27th. It's my mom's birthday, and I will be taking her to Sojo Spa in Edgewater, New Jersey. So it's her first time going. She's super excited, and I'm excited too. So I'm just, I just finished getting out of the shower and I'm just getting my things together, trying to do some skincare before we go. So it's about 20 to 30 degrees outside right now. I'm hoping that it doesn't ruin <laughs> the day there, but it should be nice because all the pools are super hot. Um, unfortunately, I might not be able to film a lot for you guys just because there's a no recording policy obviously because it's like a bathhouse but there's plenty of videos and plenty of pictures online i'll link it down below the location and you guys can check it out if you're in the new york city new jersey area i'm sure you've heard of it because it's a very popular spa destination and like everybody and their mother kind of goes there literally but um i really like it so my mom has never been there i've been there like twice or three times i think so i'm really excited to go but yeah, that's my skincare. I'm probably going to be taking some makeup because we might be going out to dinner after. So, um, or lunch, dinner, dinner, like an early dinner. Yeah, so I might be taking makeup and hair stuff just to fix my hair up. Yeah, it's going to be a good day and then I go back to work tomorrow, unfortunately. So next I'm going to put on this cream that I use for... Because I get, like, I don't know if I told you guys ever, but I get, like, um, this really, I feel like it's eczema, <laughs> honestly. And I get it around my neck, like the base of my neck. That's why it's so dark. Um, it gets really itchy um, when I'm hot and sweaty. And um, it flares up when I'm hot. So it happens around my neck and under my arms which I absolutely hate and it makes me look like I'm like like I'm itchy under my arms like because I didn't like wash but like it'll flare up and then go away and then I'd stop using this I need to stay consistent with it and use it like enough that the flare-ups like happen less because once I stop using it then a few days after me not using it it'll flare up again I'm just gonna spritz a little sunscreen in here I really don't need a lot just enough to, I should probably buy another one of this, honestly. Just put a little in there for the mirror done. I haven't got any of my new cinnamide. <laughs> I picked up this New Year headband at five below. Don't ask, I, I don't know, I thought it was cute. I'm gonna bring my brush. Clean out my hairbrush really quick because this is embarrassing and I'm not bringing this the spa looking like that Ugh. like Monique this is your sign for the new year to be to keep consistently cleaning your hairbrush like what is this what is this really you can find this on my storefront it's a godsend when I need to comb my hair or brush my hair so I think I'm just gonna put on this um, This sweater and then I'll probably change into um, something a little more nice. I have to talk to my mom because if she wants to go out somewhere after then I have to make sure that I have something <laughs> a little more presentable to wear. Okay guys so the Uber is on its way. It's about three minutes away. Well the lift. Um, I'm about to head out to so just pop, but I will see you guys in the next few clips.
she knows me very well. <laughs> We're on our way to some of the baths. Mommy, those are the harder ones. Oh, the harder ones are on that side. <laughs> this is so beautiful. <laughs> You're on the hard side. <laughs> Time to dig in. <laughs> 